Paul Revere, before the revolution, was a silversmith and an early industrialist who helped organize an intelligence and alarm system to keep watch of the British military. His contribution to the revolutionary movement, he was most famous for alerting the colonial militia to approach the British forces before the Battle of Lexington and Concord. The, his biggest moment in the revolution was his midnight ride, where he came into the where the camp where the American troops were staying and alerted them that the British was coming. Patrick Henry was originally selected to serve as a delegate in the Continental Congress. There, he and Samuel Adams worked together to unite colonists to fight the opposing British rule. Um, much later, one of his most famous moments was his, uh, his most famous speech of his career, where he said the famous words, Give me liberty or give me death. Not long after the revolution had begun, Henry became chief of Virginia's forces. He also helped write the Constitution in 1776 and later won the election as Virginia's first governor. Earlier on, he was a lawyer and politician before the revolution had begun. Before Samuel Adams became part of the American Revolution, his father had wanted him to be a minister. Instead, he went to work in a courting house, but that failed because he was never good at math and he was always distracted by talking to other people about politics. Then he became a tax collector even though he didn't want to because he didn't like taking money from people. Um, one of the biggest moments would be that he helped shape the ideas that shaped the thoughts for independence um, and he protested against the Stamp Act of 1765 and he also helped plan the Boston Tea Party. He convinced Paul Revere, John Adams, and John Hancock, even though they became more well-known than him, it was because of his ideas that shaped their thoughts. He was also a colonial activist, member of the Massachusetts legislature, and he formed John, the Sons of Liberty with um, John Hancock. He also formed the Committees of Correspondence and served in con con Constitutional Congress, which was a powerful tool for communication in the Revolutionary War. Benjamin Eds was a journalist and political writer who is best known for publishing the Boston Gazette, which sparked the Boston Tea Party and was very influential during the Amer American Revolutionary War. Eds made the paper a leading voice for independence and he often spoke critically of British policies. Before taking a central role in the revolution, Eds mainly published literary works from the earliest American poets and authors like Martha Wadsworth Brewston. One of his most important moments in the, in the American Revolution was financing and supporting the Boston Tea Party.